Hi, welcome everyone. In today's video, I'm going to tell you about how to interpolate um, several variables at the same time. For that, you, the idea behind it is that if you have uh, sub items for an index which have similar names, I will show you a few examples. Then, then it is very easy to use a loop to isolate the missing values in the data. First of all, I will show you the do file and then, then we'll, we will read the data from my computer. In this data file, I will show you that, uh, for example, there is one index which has eight items. I made sure that the, its name is in a way that it has common elements. So what I will do, so it has eight items. So I will go into the data of do file. And first of all, I will do the, make sure that it is uh, already sorted. For that, I need to make sure it is sorted according to panel data. Then I will use this command ds, the common variable, common uh, common words and static sign or multiply sign. When you do it, it will tell that it has eight items. What I will do, I will run a loop from one to eight, and then uh, by ID for each ID, I will do the isolate in which it will pick up the item one by one at a time according to the loop number and I pull it according to the year and generate a variable with a variable name and then underscore IPO when I when I execute it uh, when I execute it you will notice that it will it will create a new data so when I don't do uh, control T you will notice that if you come down there are new variables generated in which isolation has been done so using this command, you can uh, isolate the missing values in the data and, and, and quickly. So before using that, make sure that the variable names are written in a way that it can be read by a loop. So if you don't have variable names in terms of item uh, items, then what you can do is just make them VAR1, VAR2, so on, and VAR last. So that then you can just count the variable numbers and then do the isolation. It will fill out the missing values. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you understand this video and you will be able to use it, use this to quickly isolate the missing data in your data file. Thank you.